Well, as you're waking up with us this morning, you're probably thinking about breakfast and who doesn't love donuts? Well, this morning we're talking about a new donut shop in Metro Detroit with a very special twist. Joining us right now is Lori Weigler from Fractured Prune Donuts to talk about this new place in Canton, right? Yes. You guys mm -hmm. just opened up a few weeks ago? We did. We're on Michigan Avenue and back. All right. So how does this thing work? I see donuts and a bunch of toppings. So it looks good. Okay. <laughs> well, when you come into our store, all our donuts are hot, fresh, made to order. They're different in that everything is time sensitive. It's got to be the right temperature. It's got to be the right dough, the right mix, the right consistency. And it's coming out as you come in. So everything's hot and ready to order. So you can pick from, you can take a menu and pick from any of our preconceived donuts. Okay. Or you can let your inner donut genius shine and you can make your own on the back. Nice. Glazes and toppings. Yes. All right. So you can pick from, you know, multiple different toppings, multiple different glazes. We have 13 toppings and 16 glazes. Um, we also have something called a hole in one. So if you like ice cream, you can add ice cream on top of your hot donut. But you come in, you choose the donuts, we make them fresh. We use our what's called a plain Jane, which mm -hmm. is similar to a cider mill donut. Okay. And we use the plain Jane hot donut to make a finished product for you. All right, so customized donuts, really. Yes. So what, what do we have here? What's this topping? This is one of them right here. You've got them yes. uh, on the menu, right? This is the Black Forest. Okay, so raspberry so glaze, mini chocolate chips, and powdered sugar? That is correct. All right. So the donut's hot, and you dip it in there. You kind of move it around a little bit to get the glaze oh, to stick. Oh, that's good stuff. And then you put it in the powdered sugar. Okay. And then from there, you dip it in the chocolate chips. And then there you have. I think I could get your donut. Not bad, huh? <laughs> All right. So how did you even come about this? I mean, why start this business? Well, you know what? I'd heard about these donuts for years. It's a unique concept out on the East Coast. It's been around for about 40 years, and it started in Ocean City, Maryland. Mm -hmm. And I loved the concept. I'd never had the donuts, and we met the person who started the bought the franchise. Decided to take it national. We decided we wanted to be the first one here in Michigan because we know we love our donuts here. So. Now, you're going to make one too, right? What's, what's this sure. other creation here? Okay, well, this is one of our more popular ones. It is the French toast, but we add bacon to it. So French oh. toast is one of the most popular. Adding the bacon, it's now called the bacon bomb. Okay. So you take the maple glaze. Oh, now that. Although in that the store, shine. we usually are wearing our gloves, but <laughs> right, for here. Right, right. A little bit of cinnamon sugar. Oh, my and goodness. Boy, a and a little some bit bacon. of bacon, and we have what's now called the bacon bomb. The bacon bomb. So, if folks want to do this at home, I mean, if they've got their own donuts, how easy is it to make kind of their own glaze like this? Actually, it's really not that difficult. Of course, it's not the same fresh donut that we've got, but if you do it at home, you can take any kind of a honey glaze. Mm -hmm. It's usually the base. It's three parts to one part. We use fresh, um, fresh ingredients. So we have fresh berries in our in our topping, so they could mm -hmm. just take some fresh fruit, any kind of fresh fruit they want. It's about three parts glazed, a one part fruit. Mm -hmm. Put it in a blender, mix it up, and then you can use toppings like we use for our carnival that you can just get at a Target or any place like that and make your own. Um, and also, if you're at our facility, it's completely nut free as well. So at our facility, it's a little easier to make sure that there's no nut contamination. That's great, and I love this because you've got like this, this menu and all these choices. What are some of your, your most popular? Um, well, the OC Sand is actually our number one overall that everybody loves, which is just the plain Jane with the um, um, maple glaze and the cinnamon sugar. That's great. And how much do they cost? Um, it's $1.69 for one donut or $14.89 mm -hmm. for a dozen. Terrific. And uh, really, what's been the response been like so far? You know what? People love them. And we had hoped for a cult-like following like <laughs> they have on the East Coast. And we seem to be getting that. And they love the made-to-order concept. And everybody that's in there just raves about them. We've gotten fantastic reviews from food bloggers and the local people that come in every single day. So people that are driving all the way from Toledo, Clarkston, it's been amazing. All right, good stuff, Lori. Thanks again. And real quick, once again, your location, Canton. Canton. We're on Michigan Avenue and Beck Road, right over by the Canton Sports Complex. All right, terrific. Thanks so much for being Thank here. Thank you. We'll have more information on our website, wxyz.com. Just check the scene on 7 section.